Bring it in. Bring bring that thing in. Bring him in. Bring, yo, how much you taking? How much you taking? Oh my god. <laughs> hey, you wanna see some more style points? I just feel like styling on people today. I'm not I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Gator and we're back on Showdown for some more Showdown live action. I don't know if you can hear this squeaky, squeaky chair. Actually, you probably can't because the music is going to drown out all the background noise like it usually does. But we're finally in the new place, in my new crib, chilling. We can night outside. My damn curtains are terrible because I can still see like straight through like fucking like it's like I'm outside. But hopefully no one's looking back because I'm definitely not just in my boxes right now. That's besides the point. Uh, my internet, dude. My internet has has increased tenfold. I mean, before I had literally like five downloaders, some ridiculously low download and upload. But now, uh, we got some power. Uh, where is it? This, this is what we work with right now. We we back in business. I, I've had more powerful internet. I've, I've had two out two hundred upload and download back in Okinawa, but this is definitely more than acceptable. Of course, more than acceptable. Um, I did a test upload thingy and it only took like 10 minutes or something. So we should be good to go, which means more videos <laughs> until I become inactive again and just fall off the faces of there because it's Gator, not because of Alligator. But anyway, oh yeah, background, claim more, great anime, change background every time. I'm, not, I'm probably not going to do this every time, I'm going to forget, but this is definitely one that you should watch. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Well, anyways, let's just join, join with you in the chat, whatever. Rate your hazard removal skills. Our team has Diancy as hazard removal. So we'll go with bad. Go with bad, yeah. Okay, anyway, let's look at the team. So we got the Diancy. It's rock polish, no protect. I've never used Diancy before, or at least I don't remember using it. It's a mega that I'm not that... Uh, used to i mean i'm used to playing against it enough so i i mean i guess in that aspect but it's not rock polish diancy so that's gonna be something a little different but what we got here is the good old nasty plot baton pass celebi every generation i've used this shit at one point or another in fourth gen fifth gen sixth gen we, i just i don't know i just like i just like what this thing can do um the versatility it switches in the most common crap like Rotom and I, I don't know about Clefable but to an extent yeah Clefable all this stuff that just wants to just sit there and just be annoying Celebi is just like the annoying counter we bring it in it eats up the status it can set up it can leave it doesn't get pursuit track because baton pass I guess revile is an exception so like whatnot I think we have enough speed to outspeed uh yeah that up. is that outspeed Jolly Bishop or is that speed type I'm pretty sure Jolly Bishop is 262, right? I mean, whatever. But yeah, cool Celebi, and we got plenty of things to pass it to, including that Rock Polish Diancy, which uh, this, these are all dream case scenarios. It probably won't happen, but you never know. The Gengar is back, just four attacks. Uh, this is another Pokemon that I always use like every gen. I don't know. I just threw some Pokemon that I like. Uh, oh yeah, and so we got the Rocky Helmet Chomp because one thing I don't like about Celebi is the fact that. Everything in the tier just wants a U-turn on it. Landorus, Tornadus, Scizor, you name it, it's just U-turning. You want a U-turn, you take some damage on the way out. We got the Rocky Helmet, plus Celebi Combo. And then we got another thing to pass to, maybe Manaphy, just a water to not put too much pressure on Celebi to take hits from like Keldeo and stuff. I only play tested this team one time, and I ran into an HP bug Keldeo, which just destroyed my Celebi. But it locked himself an HP bug, so that's not bad. And then we got caught in the trap tran because uh well we have 50 bajillion special attackers so we want to kill chancy but anything yeah pretty straightforward uh hopefully you don't hear too well the cicadas aren't out right now dude but like during the daytime cicadas would be chirping so i don't know how that's gonna go and i don't know if i sound any different because the whole atmosphere is kind of different at one not i like this place a lot more than the last one i don't know if i mentioned this but the last one Terrible, terrible, terrible. Freaking, there's a school like two feet in front of my place, and the bell goes off 8 30 every morning. It's terrible, it's just gross. Like, the whole place was like dingy brown. This place is like clean, like slick black floor with the white walls. It's just like, ooh, ooh, pretty clean. 
pretty clean. And it's actually bigger than the last place, which is not, not by a lot because it's Tokyo, but a good by a good amount. Like my bathroom, I can take more than one step. Like literally you walk in the bathroom, there's one step and then there's the everything. But there I can like take four or five steps, you know. Here, we got a nice little spacious little... <laughs> we live in, we live in. So, Megmanetric can be a huge problem because you're not speed up tram. Um, so we're gonna have to kill that somehow. <laughs> Matter you could have just let off with it. Yeah, we, we don't have much for that, honestly. I can still lead off with Diancy. Um, or Heat Train. Heat Train's not a bad lead. Let's lead off with Heat Train because he could try to lead off with yeah, something that beats Diancy. This is one of them. Unfortunately, I don't think I do enough damage to this. But at the same time, this is actually useful. Heat Train's useful. We have the option to taunt or earth power. Um, Toxic spikes can be very, very annoying. I'm just gonna taunt. We don't want the toxic spikes. We take some damage. Okay, so we just don't take damage. Yeah, the toxic spikes just destroy our whole team. So we can't have that at all. Uh, do we want to preserve health on this? Maybe. It's gonna be a bad option, but like, what is our switching then? Manaphy? I. This is another Pokemon I'm familiar with. Uh, with using. I'm pretty sure Tentacle carries like what, Clear Smog or Haze or whatever. So boosting isn't that great. Garchomp doesn't want to get burnt. Celebi. Hmm. I think that's the thing that's going to take the electric attack up as well. I think Manaphy is going to be our one to go into. Because I don't want Celebi and Heatran taking too much damage. And hopefully if I do this, he's scared of uh, Psychic. Even though it's plus zero, I wouldn't be scared of it. This hard switches into Manectric. Does a Thunderbolt kill us? Because I know Magnezone's Thunderbolt doesn't kill us. So I don't want to calc that because I don't know some of those damages. Uh, I'm going to say it doesn't, but just just to see. Because then it has to do like, okay, what is that? 37.5? Let me take a look. Get on my face. Do I kill this? I plus three? Just to make sure. Because this isn't getting on my face right now. Yup. You're the biggest threat to my team, you got eliminated right this instant, that 30% chance. Oh, you just Volt Switch. Well, something else dying then. That's okay. Lucario dies, everything else he goes into that doesn't die gets outsped. So, something's dying. Okay, how much is this doing? Okay, that actually did 26%. So, we're not killing anything. I thought Manaphy was 5,000 times stronger than that, but apparently this is the weakest thing ever in existence. 747 special attack, huh? He's gonna do that. Uh, I have to beat this. Oh my god, I did so much. He's gonna eat speed though. I have a Gengar. Let me style on him. Get some style points. Yup. Now we're gonna focus blast. For extra style points. Come on. Come on. Come on, let me hit that. Let me hit that Gengar. We, we've been through a lot together. Woo! Gone. Alright, that's not a counter, bro. That's just not a counter. I'm sorry. That's how it is. It's not a counter. We can still, yeah, we're still gonna lose to this. So I'm gonna count in if T Bolt kills this one as well. Maybe I'm just overestimating how strong this is, and it's not as strong as I think. And I can probably just tank hits with like everything. Thunderbolt, 74 to 87. How much we got? 84. He's gonna Thunderbolt. I don't see why he would full switch. Doesn't Chestnut like wall Gengar? Very sludge. I, I don't know which move it blocks. <laughs> I don't use Chestnut. He just full switches again. Why? Because I have Garchomp? I don't know. This better do a lot. This is fucking nothing, dude. I don't have. Oh, I got some death drop. Thank goodness. Haxing and relaxing. I don't have taunt on this because uh, I don't know. I just want to kill Landers. Should probably put. And I have taunt on Heatran too. What is he letting this take so much damage for? What? Wait. Did Tyrannosaur just die or something? Oh, it did just. Okay, I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Um, we can go Heatran and Earth Power. Seems seems good. Diancy, this is our chance to get our Mega off, but he has a Skarmory, which is like hard walls. What else can we Mega against? I guess this whole team, because how fast is it? Actually, actually, not that fast. We actually can't Mega against anything. I guess yeah. I guess I'll speak. I don't, I don't. I don't actually know. 
So, I want to go Heechin. But I also want to go Diancie. Just to Mega Evolve. And the sand's up, so like his attacks aren't going to do that much. But he's just going to go Skarmory. Okay, I'm just going to do this. I just want to Mega. I want to use my Pokemon. Like, I, I put it on the team. I want to use damn thing. Oh, just Moon Blast him. Get a little chip. I did a lot. What? Thing is broken. Diancie is broken. We could see him doubling. I don't know what he would double and do. That, I don't care. I'm just gonna hurt power. We should do enough. I did enough. One layer is fine. Two layers is where it's bad. So we'll take this one layer to the bank. And knock him out. And then, I don't know, what he, I guess Lucario is the only thing. Yep. Oh, we have a Garchomp. Probably has Ice Punch. That's probably what Lucario's run in 6th gen, if anything. Would be Ice Punch. So I think what's better is to just sack Manaphy. And then go. Because there's no way he's Extreme Speed Bullet Punch. And this dies to Extreme Speed anyway. Because I could see him Ice Punching here. I don't want to just throw my Garchomp away. SDs. Sure. I mean, pretty sure he's going to E Speed my thing anyway. My uh, Diancie. It's probably going to do 5 million, but it shouldn't kill? Right? Do I have another option? I don't know how much this does. It's better not do that much. Okay, he just left. Oh, we crit. Dude, why is that doing so much? Like, why is it doing 30? So he's just full fizzed up, right? Because that's doing so much. Hey, let's kill this right now. Let's go ahead and kill this. Nice. If that didn't kill, I'm pretty sure we can still lose Lucario very easily. Uh, I just don't let him set up. I think actually Selby can't touch him. Well, and I have Rocky Helmet Garchon, so he's just gonna kill himself on the helmet. Ah, uh, he can still win. This is definitely doable for him to still win the game. Definitely possible. Does Thunderbolt kill this. Sans not up. Might kill him. I might just be dead. I'm rash. I don't, I don't remember what Rash does when it kills Tyranitar, it does that much. 76 max? I'm at 76, so. But if I if I let this die, can I lose to Lucario? It is life for Lucario, is it? Okay. I don't see my other switch, I don't, I don't know why I would go Celebi, but if the HP Ice is like some madman. Um. Because Celebi's like the thing that would take a hit from the Lucario. Actually, I'm probably underestimating Fizz Death Guard Chomp too. Probably just lose an Ice Punch. Okay, I'm gonna go Celebi. I think Guard Chomp can just take an Ice Punch. I'm never gonna let him SD. Why does he full switch? What is, what is this guy's problem? <laughs> this guy has some problems, dude. He, he's only clicked Volt Switch with this Manectric. What did that accomplish? What if I just Moon Blasted? You just lost another Pokemon? I don't, I don't know what's going on. I'm just gonna kick a drink. Because these, and this should put it to where it doesn't matter what he clicks. I'm pretty sure every move this thing uses is contact. And I'm just gonna sack my Garchomp because it doesn't do anything. It actually doesn't do anything. I just need Moonblast to start hitting stuff and Heatran and all the rest of my stuff to start hitting stuff. Not the Garchomp. He has Iron Tail. Oh my god. I did 5 bajillion damage. But Garchomp's busted and lived that. Garchomp just lived a plus 2 stab, Iron Tail, Life Orb, Lucario. It just, it just lived it. I bet you're going to Volt Switch right here. Go ahead and Volt Switch, bro. Where's a Volt Switch at, man? What was that? What was that? Terrible. I think I can just go Heatran and Earth Power. If I miss Magnus, I'm going to lose. I think Cel no, Celebi's just too healthy anyway. This is Earth Power. Bulges is out. I could have magnus on like a boss, but I'll just risk it here after he brings it in. Because just in case he stayed in and thunderbolted, that's the only reason why. So now we're going to hit this storm. 75% is 100%. Okay, that one's going to miss anyway. That one's going to miss. No problem, no problem. No problem. No problemo. That's not, okay, we're not dying to any attack though. Yummy. 
I mean, that's okay, Heatran. You got this, bro. You got this. That's my friend, Heatran. Nice. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> okay. No problem. Yeah. And I don't even think Celebi dies to create HP Ice. It's just, it's too fat. Celebi's too fat. Oh, I'm sorry, Flamethrower. Whatever, whatever. I guess it could have died to a crit overheat. Actually, overheat probably just killed it, huh? But then he's not killing the antsy with anything. So, that's fine, too. Okay. So, this is an electric. Even though it beat us, it didn't beat us. Ah, see? The classic Volcanion plus Tyranitar wombo combo. Just hit everything on my team. But I have Celebi. So, we can't spam Steam Eruption. He actually, he, okay. He cannot trap my Celebi. Oh, it's a Scarf Tar, and then it's Mind Games. Um, and he can't really trap Manaphy, so this dies. So I think Volcanion won't be too much of a problem. It's like nabs a burn on my Manaphy or something, or fire blasts on my things like Celebi or whatever. Um, <clears throat> Probably Lee's Landers, I don't, I don't know, Scizor. I don't like leading. I, I should just be one of those scumbags that leave Manaphy. I hate when people leave Manaphy, so I should just do it to somebody. Nah. Yeah. Why not? Um, there's a downside to where I don't have a audio switch in because my Chan is fully offensive, so it just dies. Could leave Gengar as well. For some reason, I feel like he's going to leave Scizor just because I have a Diancie. Or Landorus. It's Scizor or Landorus. And he has. I'm going to leave Manaphy. You look clacky, what the fuck? What the actual fuck? I don't like tell going to bitch's face. <laughs> Sounds sweet. I'm sweeping right now. Uh, he probably set up some spikes and he'll probably beat me as one of these other sweepers. I like clefky. I guess clefky beats Diancy, right? Just flash cannon? So, so that means he has flash cannon if you brought it out, right? Or I guess play rough. Or just an attack. He has an attack. Because it does not beat Diancy if you have just four freaking prankster things. I think we're okay here. The counter. It's gonna scald anyway. I don't care if he has a Volcanion. I think that Latios instead. Take this damage. That did nothing. What is this? Oh, got a burn. Why did that do nothing? Am I not max special attack? I'm so confused. Why is my attack doing zero? Man, if you're garbage, I'm a plus three. I expected that to do like 80. <laughs> that should do at least 80. So if we go into heat and we take 5 million. Um, I don't. Okay, we can lose. I guess we have Garchomp for Scizor. He's gonna go into heat and take 5 million. He could Surf too. Thunderbolt. So there's no way you have Thunderbolt and Surf, dude. I'm taking so much damage. This is a stupid idea. I, reg I regret doing this. Okay. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Hey, hey. Yes. Alright. Nice damage. Nice chip. I don't know the skills. We're offensive. This thing's for death is not that great. I might be just sacking my mon. So I will calc. See that? This is why you have the damage calculator. Situation is just like this. 58 to 69. That boy is at 74, and I don't know what he's about to click, because I have a Celebi and a Paralyzed Manaphy. Or maybe I just sack this, because this thing's such a threat, if he just clicks the right move. I have a Celebi, dude. If I go Celebi, and he Fire Blasts, then what? I go back into Heatran, and just start clicking moves again? I guess he has no switch in if I do that. Let's do it. I can see him fireblasting though. Okay, he actually didn't, but I could have seen him fireblasting there as a thing. I want a baton pass for momentum. Hmm. Because yeah, I can see him going scissor, which means I can get a rock in his face. I need a baton pass for some clean momentum here. Baton pass is so nice and safe, dude. Screw you, Turner Volt Switch. This is beautiful. I just click it. It's our timer. Hurry up. He stayed it. 
three. Yeah, it's, I mean, he stayed in though. And he's doing half to my mana fee. Okay. This is why the Tomp is nice and safe. I mean, I guess U-turn would accomplish the same thing there, so that's not a, that's not a good example. But you get my point. All I, all I know is that he stayed in. The Latios. If I tank a Draco, I, I'd rather just recover, but I don't know if I do because my Spadef is very... What the hell? I hit caps on accident. So B. 81 max. I have a Diancy. Let's go on Diancy. It's not Mega yet, so it's bulky. This thing's bulky. Yo. Please either burn. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. You let it scissor uh, Mega? That's fine. Oh, I really hope he turns around to take damage. This is why we got the Helmet Chomp. He just takes damage. <laughs> but he wants, he brings him, he puts himself in this situation where he, it's pretty much a lose lose. He just, he, yeah, it takes some damage. Oh my god. He just took damage from what? Let me get my rocks up. Defogger dead? Yeah, thanks for the rocks. Okay, he's gonna go for his own rocks. <laughs> um, there's a Dragon Tail. I can go straight in the Gengar. There's a Tyranitar. Um, okay. Oh, it's Tyrant? No, okay. So his Landers. Probably the rocker, and then it's our entire scarf or band. No, it's probably Bantar because it's just paired with Volcarona. And not Volcarona, not Volcanion. So probably just banded Tyranitar. So you Gengar can just destroy his team. Um, I could go into it. Like Dragon Tail, he's gonna he's gonna click Stealth Rock here. He could click Knock Off, is the thing. But I'm feeling it. I mean, sometimes when you're just feeling it, you just gotta do the play. Yeah, when you're feeling it, you're feeling it. Gonna icy win this fool. You can switch, but I don't care. I'm just gonna icy win this madman. <laughs> Cause I think Scizor dies to rocks plus icy win plus shadow ball. That, that should be a calc I should be running, but I might just I'm just gonna assume it dies. You could also go into Tyranitar, and if it's scarf, that means I outspeed it after the speed drop, which is my main reason I'm icy winning. Just in case he's scarf tar, because it's clearly choice Tyranitar compared with the Volcanion. Unless it's Chopple, which would, it's just counter. Counter team. Um, he can also stay in to try and U-turn because he probably thinks I don't have Icy Wind. I don't know. Yeah. Icy Wind's not that common on Life Orb Gengar to begin with. So he probably just tried to get the slow U-turn off and let his landers take 5,000 since it's basically useless since I have like a bajillion special attackers. But we just kill the landers instead. And now the good thing is if he goes to Rantar and tries to pursue trap me, I get to Mega with my with my dude. My Diancy. He goes Klefki instead. I only just want to Shadow Ball this. Yeah, he sees I have a Paralyzed thing anyway. I just want damage. I want more damage than that. Give me more. I don't want him winning with late game, um, late game guy. What's it called? Scizor. Give me more. He can still do it. Attack him. Don't get Paralyzed, good. Now we want him to kind of trap us, I guess. It doesn't really matter at this point, though. I'm not switching. Did a job. Good job. Good job, Gengar. Good job. We can lose to this Scizor. Garchomp is really freaking low. We crunched. That could matter, dude. Must be nice. If we go to Yancy, I think we have to, um, we have to Diamond Storm. I mean, Moonblast is still good damage. Okay, well first we have to go Diancy. It's not even a question. But can Diamond Storm kill this? No, Scissor has so much defense. What did I attack this with? I didn't attack it with anything, I just took helmet damage. But that look how much this bullet punch dude. Is that I'm gonna calc this. I don't know if you can hear my chair right now, but it's super freaking loud. <laughs> this might be the new thing, but I'm I, I'm assuming the background music will drown out. <laughs> okay, so this thing is bullet point. So this is it's offensive. I assume it's offensive because there's no reason we're going to be spamming spikes like that. But we don't want him 
as Dean at all. Why did I? Diane C. Dinosaur, and they, they start the same. Come on. 40. Yeah, I'm just gonna dinosaur. Unless this is like a lot too. Wait, how much is he coming in at? Is there a chance to kill? No. Okay, please move by. Never mind. Just move by then. That did five bajillion. Definitely banded. So we're not gonna let him as. I'm just gonna spam Moonblast. I mean, I guess it, I let him SD in that sense, but it puts him in a range where he just dies to the helmet. So I'm just gonna Moonblast. So attack. Yeah, and, and he's just dead. I'm, I, I'm assuming he's just dead here. That was like min. That was actually just the complete min damage. Is that a hazard? I can't. I can't tell. I can't see. There's a. It's 12 and that's two layers of pikes. Is it? Is it 16 or is it? Whatever. Just, just get on my face. We can just mimic Heatran because we can guarantee to outspeed this. Uh, where are we going? We're going Garchomp. Just click an Earthquake. You better die. This man, well, he doesn't even, I don't even know if he kills us. But he better if he can. Okay, he just, he just doesn't even kill us. He died anyway. And that should be game because there's no way his Volt Canyon outspeeds me. Okay, that was a that was a close one. Mesozor definitely could have beat us. Oof. All right. And off to the next. Uh, Dancy is doing some stuff. It's not doing that much, but it's, it's doing it's doing enough. Just the fact that it's Dancy. I mean, I didn't. It's not like I don't. I don't have protect. So it's not like I just lead off with it and click protect. But the fact that I have it on my team makes them just want to lead off with something that beats it. Cause like like 90% of the time someone has a dance on the team just lead off with it and click protect. Not me. I don't have it. <laughs> and I don't know, that's a good or bad thing. If you haven't done the the passing with the nasty plot and rock polish dream or anything like that, and I don't think we're ever gonna get that opportunity is the thing. This guy just loses a Gengar. As is Diancy though. If I leave Gengar and he leaves Diancy, I don't see him protecting. Um, because I could sub. I could just see him hard switching. But that's uh, we never know. We just don't know. It's gonna be Gengar anyway, because if he leaves Tornadus, I'm pretty sure Diancy like kind of walls Tornadus to, to an extent. I don't know if it's completely, but I'm a regular Diancy right now, so. I should be able to tank things a little bit. Okay, that did 10. Oh, he's life warp. It's kind of freaking mega and earth power is full. Style on him. Watch his style points. Hey, give me some. Take some damage, Rachi. Go ahead, take some damage. Bring it in. Bring bring that thing in. Bring him in. Bring, yo, how much you taking? How much you taking? Oh my god! <laughs> hey, you want to see some more style points? I just feel like styling on people today. I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Now this is the Gator of old. This is him. I can Moonblast again. <laughs> I can Moonblast again. <laughs> I have a Garchomp though. Yeah, see, I could have Moonblasted again. I could have done it, but you know, I'm 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 gonna calm down. I'm gonna relax. I'm gonna let him let him play. Let him play for a little bit. Let him do play. Uh, I don't know how well Celebi tanks things. Uh, Celebi's really useful because he has a Brilu. This is also useful because he has a Jirachi. And I don't know how well Celebi tanks things. I could see him. I'm pretty sure he has to protect here. I don't want to go Manaphine and then it gets to the KO though. I guess Manaphy's not that useful though. Okay, we're going to go Manaphy because this actually doesn't do anything against this team. Because it's just too fast. It doesn't do enough. And we're just going to Scald even though he has Volcanion. I don't see a reason not to Scald. I don't know if Volcanion can even touch us. I guess coverage. Oh, what? Scarf Loom? Burn? Never burn? I have a Celebi. I mean, he's probably gonna try and catch me with the Scarf Loom, but. Okay, he actually just doubles in the Volcano. So this guy plays super duper aggressive for no reason. So I outspeed this guaranteed, unless it's Scarf. So I'm just gonna Baton Pass first. And then we can pick Manaphy or Heatran. Uh, Manaphy's a safe option. And like we said, it's already useless. So we can just play safe now. This dude is clearly just mad. 
Yeah, he just steam eruption my Celebi. He's clearly mad that I styled on him. Very mad. Let's go back in Celebi. It was torn. We have Diancy. I'm pretty sure Diancy handles it well enough. I'm actually not so sure now that um, we megaed. I'm actually not so sure anymore. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna sack my mana fee instead. God, yeah, I'm pretty sure that hurricane would have just two KO'd us. And um, I think I get a kill now. I don't I don't I hope Jirachi does not tank this because this is strong. I'm rash. So I'm not, I'm actually not that fast at all. Can I just rock? I can't rock college anyway. Actually, this Scarf Reloom run, uh... Mock Punch? Oh, let me, let me... Let me... Hold on. I don't think Scarf Reloom runs Mock Punch. Let's try to go for game. Yeah, we're going for game, GG. Well played. Oh, see ya. See you later. Random. If he goes into Breloom, he has to click. I don't even think Mokla should kill us. The thing, okay, I thought this thing is a lot frailer. It's actually not that much frailer when it... I mean, it is somewhat frailer when it Megas, but it's actually not that much. What is this? That did half. His life orb anyway, he wasn't far. Okay. Oh, he doesn't have any more Pokemon. Yeah, this dude's a tryhard, and he got outplayed, and he got salty. And he tried to make like 5,000 plays, but in the end, it just didn't even matter, bro. I'm sorry. It just didn't matter. You tried. You tried your hardest. Actually, yeah, Volcanion could probably tank. It definitely tanks, doesn't it? Actually, I don't know. I have 460 and 364 attack. I don't know if it tanks or not. How are you up, dude? Yeah, you got played. <laughs> he really. Look, you see how many try hard plays he made? Uh. Earth power is stronger, right? I'm not I'm not missing anything here. Hey, I'm, I'm opening this cow. I'm about to throw this game. Earth power is clearly stronger, right? I'm not I'm not going crazy. Oh, what is this damage? What? That is nothing. Oh wait, oh no, this is mine. I have I'm rash nature. Mine mine kills. Yours yours doesn't. Yours is a bad set. Mine's a good set. Just get out my face. Yeah. Yep. I got the best set. You just have bad. Earth power kill this one? I have the Diamond Storm. I'll just give it max HP for the sake of doing it. I mean, I can just Earth Power anyway. Like, if it has 0 HP, it does. It doesn't kill, but neither does Diamond Storm. So we can just Earth Power. Should have went into this first. I like how he sacked his whole team instead. But we just need the damage and it doesn't. Can't. Can't do anything. Yeah, I could Diamond Storm. But then I miss, and then Earthquake doesn't kill me, he kills me, and then, well then I'd kill him with Gengar. I mean, this game was, he should've just left, I don't know why he's still here. <laughs> okay, that's, that's kind of rude. That was a little rude, but I'm not saying it to him directly. I can say, I can think whatever I want to think. I am not a nerd, you're a fucking nerd, kid. Look at, look at these nerdy plays. This dude made so many nerdy ass plays. Get out of my face. Oh man. And now I'm about to get bodied in the next one, so stay tuned. Um, this will probably actually just be the last one. It is kind of late. It's midnight. And, uh... Should I order pizza? Place closes at 1am. If I'm gonna order it. Is, uh, what is this? What is this? Oh boy, that dude got a Mega Meta Cham. <sighs> we don't have anything for that. I mean, you have Gengar. So like, we have mind games for that. But besides that, we don't have much. Uh, Celebi tanks a hit. I'm pretty sure Manaphy just dies. It's a speed tie though. I, I'll take that back. We're not in that bad of shape, but it's still not the greatest. What does he lead against like regular Protect Diancy? Is it the Metacham? Because I actually just don't know. What did he click so fast? Rotom? I can see Rotom. I think Celebi is safe because if he leaves Bisharp, I can still Baton Pass. Even though I don't, have, I guess my switch in is Garchomp, which isn't actually that great. Um, but I feel like Rotom is just like makes it. I can also just leave Gengar, start clicking buttons, soften up the te team a little bit for the Diancy. But then I'm mm, Rotom's just annoying. Fuck Rotom! What the hell is that Pokemon? What a stupid Pokemon! 
Don't leave Gengar. Start clicking buttons. Yeah. It's time to start just clicking buttons. Um, what's the first button we're clicking? Shadow Ball? Or should we just Focus Blast like turn? He has a Tornadus. I don't see why he would risk the freaking... Yeah. So this is probably AV. Okay, that's good to know. Oh, we got Speed Up Drop. Juicy. I'm just going to move Diancy anyway. Uh, him U-turning here gains a lot of momentum. Okay, he didn't. Thank goodness. He actually has no switch in the Moon Blast. That's hilarious. So we're just going to sleep him now. <laughs> Can I? I can't rock polish because I'm a uh, rock polish because it clearly doesn't do enough damage to everything. But the fact that he has no switch into this is actually ridiculous. What's your switch? In? That's not a switch in. What? Bye. <laughs> why is that his switch? <laughs> like why is Rotom? His, I guess Rotom doesn't do much in the first place. But why is that his switch in? What is he actually going to now? After does he just lose? Is it scarf? Oh, I actually don't have speed anyway. It's lame. I can see him doubling. And the tornado. But this just beats his team. I don't know why I would risk that. Because what I can just do is, uh, if I go, I go Celebi. I can actually see. It's like 95% of the time he doubles into tornadoes. Damn. Um, let me, I'm gonna check something real quick. Scarf, Scald, kill me? Okay, there's 108 men. <laughs> to that's the, um, okay, to a timid one, it's still okay. This is a tough turn. If he doubles Tornadoes and I go Celebi, it's AV, so he's not gonna do that much damage. So I can Baton Pass. What would he go into? What would he go into after he U-turns on my Celebi? I guess we'll figure it out then, but I'm almost there and he doubled. He doubled in this shark. We're okay with this because we're not um, we're not slow. We're actually a, a good Celebi that outspeeds. We can just taunt that. But I knew he was going to double in or something. I thought it would be Tornadoes instead, but this is okay. Because if he pursues my Garchomp, he just actually just loses. Okay, he knocked off. Okay, let's take some damage. Um, is he is he life work? Okay, he's life work too. I don't even want to stealth rock because this can beat my team. I'd rather just earthquake because that can beat my team, and that's not good. You get clean damage off. That has to be like offensive. What is that? Why did it do so much? One twenty. Do we want rocks up? You have a Diancy. What do you rock? I guess he... So what he did on that double is he, he understands that my Diancy just beats his team. So he's not going to think I'm going to play so recklessly with it. Which makes me want to go Diancy here because he's going to rocks, but... It's, like I feel like I'm in his head, but at the same time I just couldn't be. Because I didn't... I, he didn't double in Tornadoes, he doubled in a Bisharp, right? This turn, this turn is stupid. Him getting up rocks is super annoying because Bisharp can actually just beat my team. I think I'm gonna go Manaphy. If he gets up rocks, I can kind of kill something anyway. Fucking annoying. That's actually really annoying. I guess I just don't. Every time Bishop comes in, I just don't switch because if it SD, I can just lose. Mm. I think it's just like a 50 50. Yeah. But because it, it looks like he understands that I know what beats his team. I'm taking a long time in this one, but I can I can see this. His team is too strong. Like it's just too fast. And when one wrong play, I just like lose. I could just alternate a quick stealth rock, but I'm just gonna go Manaphy. I'm just gonna go Manaphy. Hey, did Earthquake. That did a lot. So I guess I'm not in his head, because I thought he had a quick stealth rock there. But I guess I'm just. I don't I don't know what he's doing there. Um, he just called. I don't care if he dies. Okay. Can I burn him? I don't care. I mean, he can go for rocks, but Manaphy's not doing anything anyway. Like, Manaphy doesn't do anything against these faster teams. Dragon Claw. 333. 
my thing just doesn't outspeed. It's pretty funny. Um, if I go into it, he actually might just stay in and then I just lose. Oh god, why is my Diancy this set? Where's my speed? Alright, let's go Gengar. I got Icy Wind. It has a chance to miss, but I can hit that Tornadus and just destroy him almost. Do we hit? We hit. That's 44. The speed drop. Can do it again. I can see him going Bisharp. I don't. This is kind of useful. I can go Heatran because he's AB. I can have a couple options here. I can also just go Diancy again, and then he U turns into what Keldeo? Sure. I'm gonna turn into Keldeo. Go ahead. Oh, he just hards in the. We kill this, right? We kill this in Moonblast. He's life work. This Moonblast has to kill. That just doesn't make any sense. If it doesn't, it's gonna Moonblast. Okay. Well. I'm pretty sure I got the drop on this thing. I'm pretty sure I've dropped this thing Spadef, Speed, and Special Attack. This Tornadus is just garbage. What a bad Tornadus. Can I Rock Polish and win yet? I guess he has to have BP on Metachamp, but I see a chance to go for game, especially since his um, Special Attack is dropped. I'm just gonna Rock Polish. I don't see what he Okay, I could've got a kill here. But I I'm pretty sure he's gonna sack. Okay, so yeah. I do get the rock polish up, and it's just a matter of if his meta team has a uh, bullet punch. He's gonna go into it and bluff it, or he actually has it. It's gonna be one of the two. I don't know why he would have bullet punch if he has a Bisharp. But at the same time, Dancy still beat. Yeah. Fuck. This is bad. Can I handle the rest of the mons without Diancy? So Diancy does not outspeed Metacham unless he's adamant with my speed investment. Because I have to go three. Of course not right now, I'm talking about if I switch. Diancy also is good against Tornadus. Every time I just literally click Moonblast and get a kill if it comes in on the Tornadus. And he brought this <sighs> fuck. His team's so weak to Diancy, it makes sense to have Bullet Punch. Like, he doesn't have a Moonblast switch in. Does Gengar get 2 KO'd by a Bullet Punch? I don't I don't know what I switched into here. <laughs> hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait. How much time do I have? Do I have time? Yeah, I have time. Yeah, I'm taking a while on this one. This this game. God, I hate playing against teams like... Cause his team just barely like just like just is faster than my team. Uh, what am I copying? So first of all, bullet punch definitely kills, right? Like it's not, there's no question. It just kills. Okay. Now, how much does it do to my Gengar? A fuck ton. If I sack this, how do I win? I don't. I don't know what to go into. Is the thing. Celebi? That's my Keldeo switch in. This thing has to have Bullet Punch. I'm just gonna move by. He faked out. He, he should've clicked, he would've clicked Bullet Punch immediately if he has I'm just gonna blast him again. I don't know. I just, I don't, I don't see me. I need Celebi. I can't switch Celebi in. Cause I need it for Keldeo. I need Celebi for Keldeo. Yeah, I can't switch it in. At least you can't switch in tornadoes on this anymore. How, how low is this? It's pretty low. Oh, never mind. It, it regenerated a lot more than I thought it would. I forgot what regenerator does. Good players. Those Keldeo. See this, this? We saw the Celebi. He might double again. Uh, he has no reason to not go. I'm just gonna rock. He scalded. What the fuck? Don't burn me. All right, good. Why did he skull? He has no reason to not go back into the tornadoes. I didn't. I don't know why he didn't do that. It's kind of weird. Baton pass here. Very slower anyway. He decides to just stay in. Ah. Why did? I don't know why he didn't do this the last time. We're gonna lose now. They're just gonna lose. 
Can I hit this? Can I please hit this? Can I hit? Can I hit this? I need to hit this so you can't double. Okay. No doubling. We're just gonna lose this bitch art. Cause I don't want that scald happen. I don't know. I, I thought double tornadoes was super safe. I guess he thought that too. How low is this? Tornadoes is broken. Tornadoes is actually just broken. It just comes in and it's too healthy. It's just regenerators. It's nice. It's cool. Regenerators is a cool thing. I could recover. This Celebi can still win, I guess. Maybe. Sometimes. I want a baton pass back in the tram, but if he scalds again, then I'm at half and then it's a mess. Just recover. This tornado is just getting pre health. It's just free health every time. He's gonna recover again. He's probably just gonna knock though. Yeah. Yeah, I kinda lost this game. Why am I recovering? Don't I need leftovers? But don't I need. I'm just gonna recover. That actually does zero. So that's good, I guess. Alright, Bishop takes rocks damage. Bishop's gonna take helmet and skin damage. Two. Baton passes. I mean, I can just go back. And, he's taking rocks damage. Okay, we can, we still have a chance. Like, he's just taking rocks damage. Um, I don't know if this is scarf or not. I should have been paying. How much is it doing to my cell? Be eighteen. That's that has to be. Was that scarf? Or is specs actually just that weak? I don't remember Kelio being that weak. My cell is not spit up or anything. Yeah, scarfed or something like that. He's gonna go back in the tornadoes. He he didn't. He hydro. See, I don't understand why he's not going in tornadoes over and over again. Because it just beats my whole team, right? Doesn't it just beat my whole team? I feel like he could have switched Bisharp. Yo, what is this guy doing? He trans outspeeds. I'm not even gonna magnus I'm just gonna earth power. I'm not I'm not gonna risk that uh, missing. I'm just gonna earth power. He could have just blew me away. And now I can just add Garchomp on the Metacham and go Gengar and start uh clicking Icy Wind. Yeah, I can just click Icy Wind and the Shadow Ball, and then he has no switch in. Well he can bring in Kel no he has no switch in. He just doesn't have one. Uh yeah, we sack Garchomp. He should I guess he could high jump. I have a Gengar. But I guess I wouldn't risk it. He's taking 5 million damage anyway. Actually, he took. Oh, yeah, he knocked me off. He took enough damage. Do I Icy win this? I want to Icy win. Uh, can I still win if I Icy win and he stays in? I lower his speed. He train out speeds him. He just goes in a Keldeo. And it dies. I'm pretty sure Kelly will... Oh, I need I need Gengar. I'm just gonna Shadow Ball. Or Sludge Wave. How much does Sludge Wave do? No. Wait, doesn't... Wait, what am I talking about? Doesn't another champ fucking resist? I know it doesn't. What resist? Why do I think I resist? I'm playing stupid. Maybe Sludge Wave. You have a chance to poison this stupid thing. If I can poison that'd be... Oh, maybe it just dies. Oh, goodbye. Never mind. See ya. Now he goes Scarf Keldeo and then he's gonna double in a Metatam or something. Either way, he's taking rocks. And Bullet Punch does like 50 at max. And we have... Yeah, we just... Okay, he just doesn't. Yeah, now he just clicked the train. He needs to crit Bullet Puncher. Actually, I'm pretty sure he can't even kill Celebi with anything. So... Don't burn me, just in case. Okay. Okay, yeah. I played this last one really... Scared. I played it too scared. Well, I did risk the Diancy, so that made the game take longer. Because every time Diancy came in, it, it got it killed something. Like every time it came in, it just killed something. I don't know why I let that take a fake out and not sack my Heatran. That didn't make sense. Watch me lose. <laughs> I can easily just lose this game still. But it does so much. His bullet punch has to literally crit. I'm pretty sure that's the only way. That's a uh, 
It's going down. Actually, I'm about to, I'm about to let, let's toy this dude a little bit. Go eat tran. Watch this. Okay. Actually, yeah, watch this, watch this shit, watch this shit, watch this. Who the fuck I jump kicks, fucking nerd? <laughs> okay, Gengar should tank. I should tank this bullet punch. Unless he crits and then we lose. Stop that. Okay. Whew. Whew. Yeah. <laughs> We're playing with fire. We're definitely playing with fire now. Oh my god. Uh, that was a, a little crazy there. A little crazy there. Alright. That's gonna wrap this up. Going on 50 minutes. Uh. I only got five games with this team. There's a four in this live, or did we do five? Whatever. The point is, I played one game before I recorded this, and then we just still did well with it. I don't think the team's anything that special. In fact, I think it's actually pretty bad because anything that's mediocre, like my max speed tier is what 110, and that's my Gengar. My Diancy is super slow, so anything that just has speed on it has the potential to just beat me because I don't have that much stuff to tank hits, especially with Heatran being offensive. Don't have too much to take hits besides Celebi and like Chomp. And Garchomp had no recovery, but we didn't come across like. Uh, I feel like we did come across like hyper offensive style teams though, so I don't know. But uh, that's gonna be it. Remember, we're gonna be uploading more often now with my new powerful internets. Uh, if you like, comment, video would be greatly appreciated. And it's good, and I'll see you guys next time.